Y'all ready? Yo, what's up, swag? And you already know what time it is, man. It's your boy, Kim Lauren, a.k.a. K.L. Swag. Back here with a video, man. Look, man, we are about to be doing something new, man. Hopefully, you guys like it. I told y'all that I was going to start on this. This is the first video doing this, man. I will be doing more of these, man, depending on if you guys like it or not. Only, only way I can tell if you guys like the video and if you're new to the channel, subscribe. And then also, if I see you guys watching it, you know, YouTube lets me know all of that. You know, but anyways, man, we be we will be rating NFL fits, man. We will be rating NFL outfits and how these dudes dress. You already know my name is Case What React. So you already know. I mean, I be dripping and whatever like that. And as I tell you guys, bro, you do not have to buy expensive designer and this and that and that and this. Bro, you can you you can go freaking straight to the damn mall and you can literally put things together, bro. Thrift shop, thr the, 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 the thrift shop or whatever like that, bro. Um, you don't have to pay for expensive things, bro, just to look good, you guys, just to put, you know, you know, just to be drippy or whatever like that, man, you know, you can, to be honest, um, I might, um, to be honest, actually, I'm going to start doing more vlogs and stuff like that, um, go to Walmart, you know, you can put things together at Walmart, and, 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 like I say, you can go to the mall, you can find, um, great, affordable like you know clothing you know depending on your style and how you dress bro you don't have to wear a bunch of designer stuff now if you got it like that you can do that but sometimes you don't have to always be, wear the designer stuff to be cool or whatever like that y'all but anyways bro anyways we about to get into this reaction man um first off this is miles sanders miles sanders i'm sorry you guys it's like cut up up top but you you eagles fans know who that is right you, 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 yo, y'all, y'all Eagles fans know who the hell his black ass is. Y'all know who he is. Miles Sanders, man. Now, as I'm looking at it or whatever like that, I will say, I can't really tell by those shoes or whatever like that, but, um, would this, would this be something that I would wear? Uh, mm, no, nah, not really. Um, to be honest, I feel like his... I feel like the colors like just all around, you know, just all over the place. But I can tell what he's trying to do. I do see on his um um shirt or whatever like that. It has the orange on. It has like a little orange on it. So he decided to you know to you know to get the shorts that has a little orange on it or whatever like that. But the shoes, I don't know, man. I think he's trying to match the shoes with the shirt. To me, it's a little off, and he got the red hat on and stuff like that. But I'm gonna rate this a one out of ten, you guys. Uh, I'm gonna rate this like a good old six, bro. I'm gonna rate this fit a good old six. Now, you guys, now all these fits that I will be rating is basically them going to, I guess, training camp or whatever like that. Half of these, I mean, a lot of these dudes be putting that shit on when they be going to training camp and stuff like that. But that fit right there, I already like. Um, you know, I already like it like that. Like, look at him. He wearing the um, gallery department. You can literally wear just Nike shorts with that. You know. Um, Nike literally got shorts that's just like the gallery department shorts. And they like, what, $60, $50 or whatever like that. Not too pricey, but those shorts probably like $400. Them shorts, think about it. $400 pairs of shorts? My nigga, come on. You paying for that? I don't really care if I got a million dollars in the damn account. A hundred K. Twenty K. Thirty K. I don't care. I'm not spending... $400 on a pair of shorts, you guys. But, you know, like I said, a lot of you know, the guys like doing that, bro. Now, we're going to go on to the next one. So, I gave him a six. I ain't going to lie. This drip wasn't all that to me. Now, this one right here. Right here. Y'all look at this one, man. Look at this one right here. This is Marquise Goodwin. I almost said Goodwin. Goodwin. Whatever, man. Marquise Goodwin, man. I personally feel like this this fit is hard. This is something that I would wear. Now, as you guys know, I usually don't wear shorts. I mean, I usually don't wear jeans. A lot of people that know me know I don't wear jeans. I'm always rocking shorts. Now, to you guys that's following me on, on Instagram, I will try to be more active on there, man, and posting pictures and stuff like that. But I want to build 
the you know, I want to build a community first. I, you, you know, so when I post a picture, you guys go crazy in the comments, man. Show me some love and all that stuff, man. But I'm going to start being more active on IG and posting. Now, this fit right here, personally, I'm not too big on designer, you guys, um, or whatever like that. But I do like those jeans. Um, would I wear them? It all depends on the price, you know. It all depends on the price. But I actually would. I would wear those. And I like how he got the little side chain on the side of his pants or whatever like that. That's something that I will most likely wear. Then he got the um the forces with the colors on it and stuff like that, which is actually pretty raw as hell. And then that, that varsity jean jacket, or that varsity jacket or whatever like that. I like that. And then, I ain't gonna lie, he got the little hat on or whatever like that. Because sometimes, bro, you gotta have the hat. Sometimes you gotta have the hat. He might not even have a haircut. He might, he might not have a haircut. But the hat, it covers it all. Look, you know. And majority of the time, y'all know when I got a hat on, bro, I have not had no retwist or no haircut. But I like this fit, bro. I really like this fit. Now, it's something, would it be something that I would wear? No, because it look like it's too damn hot. It's too damn hot to be wearing that and rocking that. I would probably wear that jacket with the shirt or whatever that he wearing. The shoes, I would not wear. I would probably wear some aces with that. And, um... Or Balenciagas or whatever. But to be honest, I see that Aces is going crazy. They got like a crazy collab with Stefan Diggs. And bro, <laughs> bro, bro, they look just the same. Aces, shoes, they look just the same. It, it, well, it's a certain brand. All Aces don't look the same like Balenciagas. But it's that one um brand. Um, I, I don't know. I forgot what it's called. It's like a name of it. You guys know how it's Jordan's. And they say Jordan 1's and all that. It's like a, it's a name, I, but it's a name, but I forgot what it's called. But Aces, they literally look just like damn Balenciagas, bro. You don't have to spend 15 to 12, well, I'll say 1700 for Balenciagas or 2000 for Balenciagas and Aces. It looked the damn same. So, um, that's just me, bro. Aces are like, I think, I think the price for them are like two, 216. You could go on gold. Um, some of them are like 150. Um, some are, 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 are even lower than that, bro. Some people are selling them lower than that, man. But I'm going to rate this fit, you guys. I'm going to rate this fit to a good old... Mm, yeah, I'm going to rate this fit a good old eight. I'm going to rate this fit to a good old eight. I like that fit, man. Marquis, Marquis good with a little foul on this. Yeah, so I'm going to rate that fit to a good old eight. So that's a good old eight. Now, let's get into this one. This one right here. Now, this is something that I like. This is something that I will wear. This is something that I wear to this day, to be honest. Now, um, this is something that I wear probably every day, you know. Um, I've been wearing, I've been starting to rock shirts like that, you know. And they're real good and affordable too, you guys. And, and as I would tell you guys, some people will buy them, buy them from, the, you know, um, them big expensive places they be having gallery department and all that bro because they got shirts like that gallery department got shirts like that stuff like that but when i spend 400 or 500 dollars on a damn shirt hell no <laughs> no i don't care if i'm hanging with rich ass niggas that's wearing all that stuff i am gonna be myself if you don't like me for me i don't care if you don't like me for me oh oh well i guess i don't need friends then you know, and I be seeing that shit, bro, with DDG, man, you know, um, or whatever like that, bro. I be seeing that, bro. Uh, all his homeboys and all that, they got, they all wearing gallery department, Balenciaga, and stuff like that, bro. I'm not going to be that type of person. I, hey, just know I got it. Just know I got it. But I, don't, I feel like you don't got to wear all that stuff to show that you have it and stuff like that. A lot of people wear that stuff to show that, that they have it. And you don't really have to do that, you guys. If you got it, bro, that don't mean that you have to wear all this ballistic and all this stuff. You can still be drippy and be swagged out, you know, or whatever like that. And, you know, still get, you know, you know, get, you know, get some, you know, nice cheap shit, you know. But this one right here, you guys, I like it, bro, because I already have those shorts. I think those, those might be gallery department, don't get me wrong, but I think those are the Nike shorts, man. Um, or whatever like that. I like the little bag that he got, bro. Um... The bucket hat, personally, I wouldn't wear. I wear hats like this, but um, the sporty shoes that I like, bro. Now, I don't know what shoes they are. Probably New Balances or something like that. But it's something about the the shoes now, you guys. 
people are still wearing Jordans, but it's it's about wearing sporty shoes now, bro. It's that sport look. It's that sport look. It's like it's like it's a fashion, but it's that sport look now. People are wearing Balenciagas with that the the the, the um, Balenciaga runners. Um, a lot of people are rocking those. A lot of people are rocking the Aces now. The New Balance. Those are becoming big time shoes now, you guys. Jordans are still good, but they're low, they're low key fading away a little bit, you guys, to be real with y'all. It's that sport look. The same thing that Isaiah Simmons is wearing right now. This is Isaiah Simmons, you guys, if you guys don't know. He is, is, is clean. I ain't gonna lie to you. And then what then what makes it an A plus, you guys? The leg task, bro. The leg task. I give this a 9.5. Well, no, let me look. Nah, I give this. I know. Nah, I take it back. I give this like a 7.5. Only the reason why I give it a 7.5, you guys, is because the shirt not matching the shoes. The bucket hat matching the shoes, but the shirt not matching the shoes. So I would give that like a 7.5, you guys. Is it clean? Yeah. But mm, that bucket hat and the shoes go together. But what about the shirt, my boy? The shirt got a whole different color on it, man. But I get out a 7.5, man. I'm not, I like it, though. He clean, though. Just got to give it a 7.5. I'm going to I'm a, I'm a, I'm a rate it hard. And then, yeah, a little, couple, a couple of chains. Now, this one right here. This one right here, you guys. Patrick Mahomes, the next GOAT of the NFL. Now, uh, Patrick Mahomes just seems like he's the type of type of dude that's not really into fashion and into the drip. As the guys that you as the guys that you already saw, you guys, those guys are real deal into fashion. They big into fashion, and you know, um, and it's cool, bro. Patrick Mahomes just seems like he's not into that. Just like a regular dude rocking some shorts, and I don't know. I look like that's his brand. I don't know. Uh, I'm not really a big Patrick Mahomes type of fan. I'm a fan, but I'm not that big of a fan of Patrick Mahomes, man. He's a good ass player, but I'm probably gonna have to rate this fit a five point five, bro. I'm gonna have to rate it a five point five because I don't know. Just not feeling it, bro. He look. It, it looks too like boring. It looks too boring. He looks like he's just coming. Bro, you know what Patrick Mahomes look like? He looks like he's like literally um about to go on his first day of school, bro. You know how it be your first day of school and you gotta wear the shoes that match the shorts and 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 he wearing a hoodie and stuff like that. That's how he look like, bro. He going he going on the first day of school, you guys in high school. <laughs> bro, that's how he looks like. And then I like the I like the tat. It just the tat just don't fit him. I don't know about y'all, but I don't know. It's just that leg tat does not fit Patrick Mahomes. It just don't fit. He just he don't look like he need to be wearing no damn tattoos. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. Five point five to me, bro. It just it just don't look right. It just I don't know. Looks too plain to be honest. Now, last but not least, you guys. My favorite player. My favorite player, Jamal Adams. <sighs> Jamal Adams. As y'all know, that's my favorite player, man. I personally feel like I got to give this a 10 out of 10. Now, I know you guys going to say that. Swag, you tripping and this and that. I'm going to tell you guys why. Um, I got to give this a 10 out of 10. Matter of fact, no. Yeah, I'm giving it that 10 out of 10. I'm going to tell you guys why. First off, this is something that I will wear. This is something that I will wear. First off, I'm a big-ass dude. I got big arms. Um, I've been making sure I'm staying in the gym to make sure my arms are nice and defined and stuff like that. Um, this is something that I will wear, you guys. With the cut-up shirt. Um, them joggers that I see that he's wearing. Joggers clean as hell. I can see myself holding that bag. Wearing the glasses. I'm always usually always wearing glasses, man, when I'm going out or whatever like that. Now, I, I want to see if they're going to show you guys the shoes or whatever. I don't think I don't think they're going to show them or whatever. I'm sorry, you guys. I think it got cropped out or something like that. But basically, I think he had Balenciaga shoes on, but I think they um, were, were Aces. Like I said, you guys, Aces is starting like a big, huge um, collab. And them bitches are hard, bro. Yeah, it's not showing or whatever like that. 
But he has like pink aces on, you guys. I think they're pink aces. I saw somebody comment and say that would that they were um that they were um what does it call you guys? Plink plink um pink Balenciagas, but they look like aces to me. As I told you guys, they're having a big, huge uh, collab and stuff like that with the fashion world. And it's been going crazy in Paris, man. It's not really that crazy in the U.S., but it's going to get crazy just waiting on it. People going to start wearing Jordans real soon. But this is something that I'll wear, you guys. 10 out of 10, man. He fresh as hell. i say that he, maybe he should have had maybe a couple of tennis chains on his neck or whatever like that. But this is clean as hell. Good uh, color coordinated or whatever like that with the joggers on and the um the cut up shirt man which is big right now. And I think I think even dudes as skinny as hell are rocking the cut up shirts, bro. I ain't gonna lie to y'all niggas that's wearing the cut up shirts. You need to do some curls or something. Your arms looking little as hell. But overall, bro, Jamal Adams to me was the best fit um in this damn rating um NFL fits and stuff like that. Y'all let me know down below in the comments. Who is your best fitted NFL player, man? If you guys want me to keep going with this, if you made it this far, I appreciate it. See you guys in the next video. Let me know down below how I did. And am I tripping about the fritz? You know, about the fits and stuff like that. And who else should I do next?